Uh, is this Skeptic's Corner? What is this? Um, yes. Okay. Welcome to Skeptic's <laughs> Corner. Yeah. Okay. So, hi, Kendall. Hello, Max. This video is a little more exciting than the last one. This is a drone. Quad a drone. Quadcopter. Quad. Quadcopter. Get to the chopper. Extreme drone footage. Enthusiasts. Drones. Uh, this guy is flying a drone mm -hmm. over the woods. Mm -hmm. See, she is a white thing. And he maneuvers his drone a little bit closer. White thing mm -hmm. turns out to be a humanoid. Puts its hands up and like, ah, don't look at me or some such motion. And then the drone strafes to the side and the video ends. And uh, that's it. The video is titled Black Eyed Girl was a Canuck Chase Canuck, Canuck Chase Ghost. I guess this is a area in England. Is it? Let I me double know. let me double check this this bastard piece of fact. Hang on. <laughs> Uh, yes, it is a mixed area of countryside in the county of Staffordshire, England. I guess Canuck Chase is kind of known for creepy stuff. Interesting. Mm. Anyway, um, but here it is. I mean, pretty good video, uh, pretty good creep level. Yeah, but the thing is, it could just be anybody dressed yeah. up. To you know, conveniently placed right there at the edge of the woods. Yeah. So the drone could go find them. Um. It's it's so weird. I like how everyone's like, "Why did the drone chase it?" Just like, yeah, all right, let's just fly the couple hundred dollar quadcopter of mine through a bunch like a thicket of like small trees and a bunch of thorns oh, yeah. and whatnot. Yeah. yeah. That's really. smart. Do you know what kind of drone this is? I have known nothing about drones. Uh, I just know it's a quadcopter. I know little to nothing about drones. Okay, so that's, that's our opinion. <laughs> yeah. Um, decent video quality, though. I give it that. Yeah, it's... Mm -hmm. I guess you could have flown, like, over the forest and tried to get, like, a top-down view of the girl or whatever. Now, don't, drones don't have a big battery life. Uh, I mean, they can. Some of them have a pretty high ceiling, like... So yeah. much so that most airports now ban the use of drones within a couple miles because, like, you can fly them into the path of oncoming air traffic. Oh, my God. Yeah, they're kind of a problem. Um, <laughs> I mean, I don't know exactly what the uh, drone battery life is for, for this particular model, but I kind of feel you with the whole, like, let's not fly it over a deep forest where it could possibly, like, lose signal or fall into the deep forest where I have to retrieve it. Oh, God. Right. Ooh. Okay, yeah, hang on. That's something to talk about here. Let's say that this is a real event, right? That this is an unscripted event. Well, hold up, though. Okay. Like, the first 10 seconds of the film, though, he does fly it, like, right over a forest. Yeah. So. But hang on a second. Mm hmm So let's say that this is a real unscripted event, right? Yeah. He is honestly flying it over, and he's just having a good old time. And this, some of these drones are really expensive. Let's say this is like a fifteen hundred dollar drone, right? Yeah, which is very, very, you know, not out of the realm of what these things cost. Yeah, you don't want to lose that. I wouldn't want to lose that, right? Like if you go in there and you lose this thing, you better believe I'm gonna mount an expedition to try and get my drone back. <laughs> You're gonna be using all your B-list friends to be expendable. <laughs> <laughs> Man, that would be terrifying seeing something like this and knowing your drone went down. Yep. In there? Oh, <laughs> no thanks. No oh thanks. My gosh. Woo. That'd be like one of those times I'd be like, hey, Justin. <laughs> hey, hey, Justin. Guess what, man? I'll, I'll, my, my drone fell. I wouldn't see, I wouldn't tell him about the thing I saw. It'd just be like, dude, my drone fell. You're, can you run in there and get it? I'd be like, wait <laughs> on the other side of the field. <laughs> sure, dude. And run and get it. All right, cool. You know, be careful. Why? Why do you say that? Oh, you know, it's like there's twigs. You might, you might trip. <laughs> <laughs> totally 
Wait on a demon girl waiting to suck your soul out. <laughs> nah, dude. Just get in there. Yeah. All right. Oh, so yeah. Mo- so most of the drones I find just on Amazon at a, at a passing glance that have like a decent 720 to like 180 camera, uh-huh. uh, they range for about 100 bucks. You're looking at some a little cheaper, you know, 70 and Okay. Uh, uh, the the nicer ones with like better controls, like better cameras and like better capacity, like weight capacity, better um, like ceiling limits and ranges. You're getting in more like the four hundred dollar range. Um, but I mean, it's still very doable for somebody who has an interest in this, especially somebody who wants to just like. You know, before it became oversaturated, like some of the first people who were doing like quadcopter channels of just like, you know, footage <clears throat> and stuff and putting music to it on YouTube, those were getting pretty popular before everybody figured out, oh, I can just get one of these cheap ones and do the same thing and yeah. ruined it for everyone and it's no longer cool anymore. Okay. Um, um, I have, I have, I have, sorry, I'll let you go on because I have a few things to input here. Yeah. That I just learned. So go ahead. <clears throat> All right. The video was uploaded on. April 18th, 2015, right? Mm-hmm. Okay. The channel was started the same day. He made the channel to upload the video. That's you, like... You're talking about Furious Otter? Yeah. He put the channel up to upload the video. Huh. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That's just like... I mean, it could be like, he. oh, here's this thing I saw. Better make a channel. It could be that, but it's just weird to me. Like, those. that's just one of those little things. Like, okay, what are you doing? Trying to mar- you trying to make a creepy channel here, you know? No, because he's only got a handful of videos, and none of them are relevant. <clears throat> right, but that was the first one. So that could be like, is this his first outing? And he's like, you know what? Not going to do it. Not going to do it. Because, I mean, if I had a quadcopter, I'd probably be putting up more videos of quadcopter footage. I'm not going to well, lie. <laughs> he's got other quadcopter videos, though. He's he does. Got he, one, he only uh, has one, two, two. Yeah, Mitsubishi Evo 4 Chase, and then some Night Surf comp- competition thing in 2015. Okay. So, I don't know. that. I guess it's not a red flag, but it's just usually we would frown on others <laughs> for yeah. some reason. I don't know. It's just like one of those weird little things. He made the channel to put that video up, is what I'm saying. Mm. Uh, it's not necessarily a red flag, I guess, if I'm trying to be objective, but it's just like something to take note let that sit in your mind make it mean whatever it means to you so another thing is that this was up three years ago uh Uh were drones a little higher price back then had they had they become really affordable yet uh i mean i don't really (laughs) i don't know know either economy i don't know i don't know drone economy either i'm just saying that might be something to think about as well yeah, so even I'm, furthers my argument. I'm not going to want to go and retrieve it if it crashes in there. Right. Well, I mean, even like a hundred dollar <laughs> drone, I don't want to go in. Yeah. After it, when I see that. And then what if you have like a GoPro Hero on there? Like that's a few more hundred dollars on there. You know. That's true. Yeah. If it's not one that already has a built-in camera. Yeah. 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 I'm not going in there. So yeah. I'm not going to. I'm not following the hooded creature, the hooded, <laughs> the KKK clan m- member into the woods. I'm sorry. Okay, <laughs> not fucking doing it, dude. Could you imagine? Just I, I think I've talked about this before, but just like wandering through the woods and you, you come across a KKK meeting, and it's like, well, Oof. my Oof. bad. Yeah, there's like some scary things, and then there's like scary things. Yeah, <laughs> I've talked about this with my with my buddy as well, and we we often go over lists of of like things that would be the worst to find in the woods, and that's one of them. <laughs> That's yeah. always near, and that's always in the top three. So, the people saying that he could have followed it in, I'm, no, I'm not going to follow it in. And then, what if that thing follows my drone back? I don't want it to follow my drone back. Right, give your drone the stank eye, dude. Yeah, like I don't want that thing having a vague idea of the direction it came from. You know, like, it's gonna. What if it? What if it's a supernatural thing and it can just hover? It's gonna hover to me. I don't want it. I don't want any of that stank. It's gonna. It could possibly leave on my life. You do right. your. You, you do your forest thing, all right. You do the forest thing. I'll stay out of your business. So the video says that this is a black-eyed child, girl, black-eyed girl. Um, right. 
I I have some issue with the title because the information's not there. Uh, I don't see black eyes. I don't even see a face. I see arms go up. Yeah, it's like it's like it's either like covering its face or like brushing its hair or something. Yeah, yeah. Um, it, I would say it's hooded before I say it's like a for sure a woman. You know, there's just not enough information there to tell exactly what it is. Mm-hmm. So, and of course, the possibility is easily there if you want to say that he had somebody there. To oh, be, absolutely. Yeah, that's it's so easy to fake that. I mean, he could have got closer with the drone, honestly, but. Back to what we were talking about, I, I would be very afraid of losing my drone. Because, like, what it, not even if it was paranormal, it was just, like, a person, and, and, like, they just throw something at my drone, and it gets knocked down, and they just steal it. And then that's that's my drone gone. <laughs> <laughs> drone gone? That'd be so sad. Yeah, like, what if it's just some dude, he's just like, I'm a chuck a ruck at that. And he, <laughs> like he, the- <laughs> he knocks it out of this guy and steals my drone, dude. <laughs> Look, this isn't fucking video games we're talking about here. This shit's real, man. I'm not. <laughs> when you dodge something in a video game and you get hit, you're like, ah, oh, that sucks. But when when it gets hit for real, you're yeah. like, oh no, I, got, I gotta <laughs> go get that. <laughs> My life is over. I gotta. <laughs> I have to socially engage with somebody who's trying to steal my drone. I have to socially engage with a forest person. Well, what's even worse is like <laughs> some of these have like a live feed in in on the controller, right? So you can see what's going mm-hmm. on. Yeah. It's not just like, you know, you're staring you at it, it to your sky. phone or yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So like what if you watch this person like knock your drone down and then they just like run through the forest and oh. like you're seeing a live feed of them like running through the forest. Getting closer to you? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, I guess this would not be a GoPro drone because he obviously is using it to look at something. So he must be seeing a feed. Right. Yeah, I'm thinking he's yeah, because there's no way he would like if he was down on the ground, like, yeah, looking up at it, know that there's something down there. Yeah. 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 And at the beginning of the video, I hate the cuts that are in this video, by the way. Mm-hmm. So at the beginning of the video, he does actually see it from a top-down view. Then he like goes, he backs up a little bit and then lowers the drone so he can see the edge of the forest. Right. Um, and then that's when he, you know, he sees it. And it says that he's been contacted by other, like, paranormal researchers or whatever, um, like, inquiring about it. So, Mm -hmm. I wish we could tell if the video's title has been, like, altered. Because I wonder if somebody planted the idea of a black-eyed girl or whatever. Right. And then he changed the title because one of the people who contacted him, if that is all true, like, told him about it, you know? Yeah. I mean, like, if I uploaded this, if I had caught something on a drone, right, Mm -hmm. I would say... I wouldn't say this is a black eyed girl. I w- this would the thing in the forest caught on my drone. Have a look. That's probably what it would be. It wouldn't be some pre existing idea. Because so I wouldn't yeah. want if I were posting this for people to see and give their input. I wouldn't want people thinking something, right? Going into it. Another thing is black eyed girl. That's like clickbait ish to me. If you want to go the other way with it. <clears throat> But yeah, I think it's kind of fake too. I think it's just staged. Yeah, I do. It's definitely creepy. Although I think the the possibility of losing your drone and like a weird child of the forest taking it is way more terrifying than whatever they're trying to yeah. like muster <laughs> here. Yeah, that would be pretty rough. Um cuz you, you know, know there are people who just live off the grid as like gypsies or whatever like I don't want them stealing my drone. <laughs> yeah man, I don't want Ted Kaczynski finding my drone, you know? <laughs> I don't want that. That would be horrible. You know, you know what's going to happen one day, Kendall? Somebody is going to get legit undeniable, indisputable creepy drone footage. I mean, I've already seen some. Yeah. There's a there's a There was a thread on Reddit I was reading about this guy who lives in like Northern California and he's like there's this gypsy camp that lives across the river nobody's doing anything about it so he bought mm. a kind of cheaper drone and started to fly it like, <laughs> over the gypsy camp and they're like doing weird stuff there great yeah that's like that's like real legit like w- st- forest people creepiness maybe we'll have a thing on that one that sounds interesting um and there's a there's uh there's that bigfoot video i sent you of from a drone yeah 
Yeah. The guy was just doing some like stock footage he was trying to acquire with his drone, and that, like he wasn't even trying to capture the Bigfoot because like it doesn't even try to like investigate it. It just flies over it, hmm. um, and like later in in post he saw it. And he's like, oh wow, look what I found. But obviously that can't be because Bigfoot ain't real. Bigfoot ain't real. <laughs> <laughs> but he got one, so how could that be? Yeah, um, I'm honestly shocked though. There's not more <laughs> like. Drones, yeah. catching weird things, footage. Maybe, you know, maybe it's just something you and I need to dig into. Because there's the footage of the clown, too. Have you seen the one with the clown in the cornfield? Oh, yeah. But that's so easy to stage, though, That's man. very much the same as this, but it's like, that's very creepy. I know it's probably a fake, but no good. No good. I If it's real, though, why is it there? Why are you doing yeah. that, man? Stop. <laughs> Uh, and again, I would not follow a clown into the woods with my drone. I don't want I don't want a clown taking my drone. Yeah. Maybe you and I just need to dig deep into the drone lore. The drone lore. Maybe there are a lot of creepy videos of drones finding creepy stuff, much more than we know about, and we just haven't found it yet. Mm, possibly. Maybe yeah. we should get a drone and we should find the creepy stuff. <laughs> oh yeah, good idea. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Um my consensus is that this is easily staged, and therefore, it probably is. Yeah. All right. I have nothing more to say. Quit bashing this dude for not making his drone follow it. Because I, yeah. wouldn't, make, I wouldn't make my drone follow it. <laughs> yeah, I, w- I wouldn't either. I don't... Now, things. could you imagine, though, like, you see something like this on your drone. You fly your drone back to you. Would you want to investigate further? Like, maybe go out the next day? With some buddies or something? Mm. I'm Or re-drone the area? I mean, Maybe. yeah, but i definitely make sure that, um, you know, I had buddies watching the forest around me. That's really weird, too, right? Because, like, it's kind of like you're playing on your phone or a video game, so you're, like, looking at your controller, like, looking at the screen, paying attention. Yeah. You see something like this, like, what if you're actually surrounded and you're just too busy looking at your drone footage? <sighs> Uh, yeah, I mean... Yeah, ooh, that's not good. Yeah, just zoned out, get, yeah. It's a good way to get took. It is. Yeah. All right, all right, guys. This this one was a little more exciting than the last one, so... Well, it's because we made it exciting with all our hypotheticals, but yeah. Yeah, it's fake. <laughs> um, yeah. <laughs> okay, guys, we'll, uh, we'll see you next time here on The Best 5 Minutes.